Hey, um, everybody. Um, this is Faris Al Hajri, PhD, AM, from Hakwa Awareness. Our establishment is located in Blacksburg, Virginia, United States, particularly in Virginia Tech Corporate Research Center. And for the reason is we are working to set up two separate strategies. Strategy number one is to conduct clinical research studies on the effectiveness of Hakwa revitalized therapy or Hakwapathy or Hakwapathic medicine in human subjects. We so far managed to receive four clinical trials that have been conducted in rats in a university in Algeria called the University of the Frères Mentori by Professor Dr. Zeriza. She is the director of the research as well as she is a professor teaching students in masters and PhDs. So we really our high tribute to Dr. Zeriza, Professor Zeriza, for her contribution to conduct this clinical trial using rats and specifically with the hot water therapy or aquapathic medicine or aqua revitalized therapy. From time to time, since 2003 till today, I was the first recipient in terms of my chronic ailments. I used to go get prescription drugs and I was about to die twice. I saw death in front of me. Why I say I saw death? I collapsed and lost conscious. And because my wife, Gloria, she, as a professional nurse, registered nurse, she knew what she should do in terms of assisting me on a paramedical assistance. She did not panic, she to rush me to the hospital. Immediately she just checked my pulse, heart pulse. She knew that there is no more oxygen reaching the brain. So what did she do? She took me, pulled me slowly, slowly, till she put me in bed at home. And she put me lie on the flat on the bed and she put my head below the bed level. In 10 minutes, I'm back to normal. By the time my brother came, younger brother Fouad, and my neighbor, Dr. Aileen, she's a medical doctor, Canadian. And she said, Ferris, you are lucky you married a nurse. If you did not reach the hospital in 10 minutes, either you get a stroke or you are dead. I said, why? She said, because you no longer have oxygen reaching your brain. But your wife, she knows the paramedic assistance, she rescued you. I said, wow, it's impressive. So for the second time when it happened to me, it struck me. It happened, I was in my office. But since I got the training for the first time by my wife, I just pulled myself slowly, slowly from the chair and stand. And as I delay, as time passes second by second, I start to lose conscious and I start to feel weak. I can't even control. I knew that it's getting worse. No more oxygen reaching the brain. So it's like a beginning of a death or a stroke, one of the two. So I pull myself slowly, slowly, and I'm losing control. I'm about to faint, to collapse. Slowly I went to the sofa. I put my feet up. And I lie down on the floor and I say, if somebody see me, they'll call me crazy, but let me, let it be. I'm rescuing myself, my life. And I lie down like that, my head down, my head up, my feet up. Just for a few minutes, like about 10 minutes, and I'm back to more normal. Then I knew that this was a knock to me. That was a how, uh, what I, I heard about, the aha moment. A wake up call that fairies do something. Do not stay rely 
on the prescription drugs. The doctor is doing his best, but you need to do something. Listen to your body, cry. Listen that something is getting wrong, then move forward, do something. That's where I intensify to find alternative solution, to understand how does my function, my body function. What I started to look for alternative solution by means to look for something natural connected to our body. That's where with the kitchen experiments, I discovered that something simple, you could imagine, simple with that temperature can change my life and change the life of many people. Who could expect this? Water at that specific temperature for consumption. Nobody can ever expect. Until today, many people, they still look at, look at it as pseudo science, nonsense. Listen to me, my dear brother, sister, who is watching this. Don't let this to be too late for you, too late, too late for you. This experiment started 2003. I was proclaimed asymptomatic completely, completely, out of all the four chronic diseases. Rhoni allergic rhinitis, serious attack of asthma, low backache, which is lumbago, back pain, and uh, migraine, series of migraine. Till today, this year, 2020, but to enter 2021, more than 13 years consecutive, I live my life the highest state of healthy, the physical, emotional, the mental, and spiritual. And not just that, I reach to manage to live a wealthy life, not just to be only having money, opulence, that's the reason I came to coin the five factors of sustainable wealth from the most to the least, but we need them all. We need them all together. So the first one is power of faith about how I deal with people, how my dignity with people, how I respect people, how I try to avoid controversy with people, how I try to be honest, how I try to pay my bills, how I try, I'm trying to be better me, but I say, <laughs> I never be the best, but always do my best to be the best. You may memorize that, I can say it again. I never be the best, but always do my best to be the best. I try to learn every day to achieve better me. Because, again, in my other quotes, life is a school that has an endless process of learning. Every day, we learn and learn and learn. Let me grab a gulping hot water. I take a gulp of hot water. I say gulping, not drinking, not sipping. I feel my mouth. I can tolerate the temperature does not burn, me, burn my mouth or my throat that I can swallow. That is the temperature, exclusively 50 degrees Celsius, 122 degree Fahrenheit. Hmm. That's for adults, but for children and babies and newly born babies, it's 40 degrees Celsius we can convert that to Fahrenheit, which is 102 degrees Fahrenheit. So from 2003, for consecutively 13 and a half years, going to 14 years, what did I do? I wanted to share to the world. I had to do strategy plan. So here in the United States, once we open up our establishment in the name of Hakwa Awareness, our two strategies, number one, is to conduct clinical trials in human subjects. It's a challenge, but with your support, we can do it. We can achieve. We are determined. We do not quit. We move forward. We're still climbing the endless mountains of life from one mountain to the next, one level higher to the next. I call it climbing the endless mountains of life. Never quit. Number two, 
The other vision is to set up wellness projects in various sizes and various services. Those wellness projects is not to cause controversies with the pharmaceutical industry or medical doctors or the physicians, but it's a new industry that evolved with the evolution of what's happening with the world today. We see exponential growth of technology. We see huge discoveries and, uh, and uh, inventions. Human has reached an exponential growth of technology. Look at the technological advance. But on the other side, we see the health is collapsing. So what's going on? Uh, why are we still to remain at war with an invisible enemy that attack us and destroy us and kill us and so many people that live with chronic ailment for many years? Until when are we going to suffer? Until when should we sit down and cry and cry and cry? Why don't we sit down and listen that our body is crying? Why don't we sit down and start to understand how does my body function? Why don't we sit down to understand that I am not an artificial intelligence? I am not a robot. I am not a machine. I am not a computer. I am not a cell phone. I am not a machine that is being invented by human. That machine runs on its fuel and regular maintenance, whereas you, you are not fabricated. You are not an artificial intelligence. You are not a robot. You are you. You are a human being, a super intelligent machine that was created. You may say created by God. Some they believe. I do believe. You are created. You are not fabricated. You are not invented. Now let's open our eyes. Why do we have to stay numb, blind, and deaf? Why? 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 We need to wake up. We need to understand. Look the way your creation was completed in the womb of your mother. Please, please take a moment. Give me one human being on this earth planet except the first human being. The names and the call Adam and Eve. Okay, the first human being in the history of humankind. Gen followed by that, give me one human being who past the womb of the mother who was not encountered with the amniotic fluid. Give me one. And the two tell, can tell me amniotic fluid is not hot water. Do you know why? It's 99% water. The percentage of the water. The temperature is 37.5 uh, degrees Celsius. We can convert to Fahrenheit, which is one degree higher than the normal mother's temperature. So who made that? Who created that? Who made that? The one who created you. You were created. You were not fabricated. You were not invented. So you were created with that super intelligence system that your body formed. And the moment you are born, you are disconnected. So the moment when we discover that the hot water from the component of the hot water, the hot water, the elements, the specifically, exclusively, water, oxygen, hydrogen, energy, those are the natural toxic free fuels that provided to you that have resulted to the completion of your fatal growth. Now when you're born you are disconnected. Who could imagine by just one of the modalities of Hakua Revitalize, Hakuopathic Medicine, Hakuopathy is the gulping method, that's the most important drinking method for internal use. Follow the specific method, methodology, understand the Bikadu principles, the belief, implement, continue, appreciate, discipline, and understand. The more you are into it, listen to me, you will live the healthiest life ever. And we invite pharmaceutical industries to join us. Instead of the money, the billions they're spending in research and development for drugs, it takes it cost one billion dollar, one billion, to discover a new drug. And it takes up to 15 years to go through the process of approval. Now, we invite 
pharmaceutical industry, bring your money. Let's set up project, which is the strategy number two. Set up wellness project, wellness centers, wellness center and lodging facility, wellness resort and spa, wellness cities all over the world. So bring your money. We do not pose a threat to the pharmaceutical industry. Rather, we believe on collaboration and not on competition. Because competition destroy whether competitor or the other one who create the competition. I mean, the one who received it. I mean, both parties, they always, they end up losing. We do not believe on competition where we believe on collaboration. Let's collaborate, we can do better. Same thing with the medical industry. Serving the medical industry, the doctors, physicians, and so on. They can serve those projects. They can be providing the service in diagnosing of any abnormality of the human body and provide the services in terms of guiding a human being. Because a human being does not need to be treated. He needs to be revitalized and energized. You need to understand the same as with a nutritionist. A nutritionist does not sell food, but provide information that can impact your life. Understand what is your body can benefit from what food you are eating and so on. Same thing with a psychiatrist. He provides you or she provides you information that can give you to cope with the stress of life and so on, anxiety, disorders and so on. That is aquapathic medicine. We do not treat diseases or alleviate. We don't need to treat people. We engage people to treat themselves by themselves by revitalizing the body Revitalize is to reinstate back to the stage you were created in the womb of your mother. What are these essential elements, natural, toxic free elements that have made you completed in the womb of your mother till you were born? What do they do? How are they substantiated through the clean through the, the, the scientific methodology? We talk about science, we talk about biochemistry, we talk about the laws of thermodynamics, we talk about physics as in general, we talk about the chemistry, we talk about anatomic of human body. There's no controversies here. The information we provide are fully scientific. We just need a clinical trial to prove it to, to the world that this is what's happening. But till that time happens, you need to move forward and believe because it's for you. I got my portion, my family got, and many followers who follow this, they got their portion. It's your time. Stay away from arrogancy because I came with a quote to say, dealing with humans is worse than, is worse than A horse, not just a horse, but what do you call the horse that lives in a desert and a forest? I forgot you may you may remember that wild horse. Yeah, so that's how human is difficult to convince especially when it comes to something toxic free, easy, available everywhere. During our interview with NBC Dubai 2012, they say this simple element and free and cheap. It's true, it's simple and cheap because you don't buy oxygen, you don't buy hydrogen, you don't buy energy, it's there, it's free for you. You don't buy water, okay, you may buy the bottled water, but water, I mean, or you pay the bills for your consumption at home, but water through rain, water is there everywhere. Do not underestimate, this is the ultimate solution. So this is an evolution that's gonna change the world. This is same thing with many industries. They have taken a new form. They evolved into the new evolution, a new industry, and so on. With the new health industry, is taking a new evolution. There's no way. It's unstoppable. Hakopathy. We are inviting as we invented 
the hakuapathy. We invented by means we dis we are the founder of hakuapathy. Let me take a gap, excuse me. Being the founder of hakuapathy, hakuapathic medicine, as you heard, hydropathy, osteopathy, and so on, so on. This is coined as hakuapathy. Aqua did not do hot aqua, and aqua is a Latin word, water. So hot water in the general public knowledge. Aquapathy, or aquapathic medicine, or aqua revitalize is a process to revitalize and energize, revitalize back, bring, reinstate the human body back to a state of the function originally created in the physical form, emotional, the mental, and spiritual. And energize, keep you, because you need that continuum energy to keep your cells compensating the cells that die, apoptosis. Now, so from time to time, since 2003 until today, what we've been doing to keep on increasing our knowledge and moving forward and understanding what we want to achieve, and to set up this project very soon by inviting investors or getting grants or funding to move forward we have been working with strategic plans. Now, from time to time, what we've been doing is to keep spreading the awareness. And those awareness, as we've been doing this, and it's a non-profit, so that's the reason we need also part of our plan to set up wellness organization, non-profit, to keep this awareness continuing well registered so that we can get funding, support to move forward and also open a college of aquapathic medicine so that we can train people and get the certificate in, in the, related to osteopathy and uh, uh, holistic practices and add aquapathy as uniqueness. So they can have the license and they can have the certificate, the training, and they can open their own center or they can work with the centers or this project as we talk about. This is the vision. Now, so far, what we've been doing is to conduct lectures. So far, I've already conducted more than 65 lectures in universities, in schools, in colleges, in places of worship, like mosques, churches, and so on, different, in the public, for organizations, for companies, for individuals. We have been doing this for the last 13 and a half years. Two, we have presented eight conferences, international conferences, present our paper, our speech in San Diego, in Melbourne, Australia, San Diego is California, United States, in Melbourne, Australia, and other countries like the Philippines, in India, in, in, uh, in Oman, in Dubai, in Abu Dhabi, United Arab Emirates, and so on. Then we have been also interview and uh, in different media, 95, 92 so far, that covers live TV, radio, magazines, newspapers, press releases, and so on. So what we keep on continuing this campaign to move, to bring the word, to spread the word. And from time to time, we've been into in our channel, which is mixed up with a videos presentation in Arabic, in, because I come from an Arab country, I'm coming from Oman, in English. In Swahili, I'm born in, in Africa, so I speak Swahili, Hakuna Matata. I speak Swahili very fluently, and there will be another video I'll present here about in Swahili, some other Dr. Levides. In French, I studied French till my high school. In Egypt, I, f I went to Egypt to study, to learn Arabic, and also to continue my study in French, because since my first year, in Africa was in a French school. So I speak French. Je parle français comme le français. Well, from time to time, we do live uh, stream YouTube, sometimes other social media, to get engaged with the followers, with the subscriptions and so on, those who follow, most especially from the Arab countries, mainly the follow. So we keep engaged, we keep them engaged, and we collect anecdotal evidence 
We interact so that we can keep on learning. We can also transmit information and keep help others change life of others, impact life. That's our vision. But we need your support. Each one who is watching this video, please, we need your support. Together, we can make a better world. Together, we can make our children happy, living the true, wealthy life. Together, we can make the upcoming generations living the wealthiest life ever. Together, we can impact the world, same as what the technology, the giant companies like Google, Microsoft, Amazon, and all this, they've been doing amazing. So many companies are doing amazing, ameliorating the services to the people and people enjoying these new services at even lower cost. So let's move forward in terms of a healthcare system so that we don't have to fear this pandemic that attack us from time to time. Remember, this just only coronavirus is only, it just started 2003 and now we have the fourth pandemic, COVID-19. That's strike what you have seen. And already a wave, new wave of this pandemic keep on mutate these viruses in a new form. And every three to four to five years, we have a new virus that come to attack us. So we are at war with a foreign invader that we don't know, we don't see. We know, okay, but we don't see by neck eyes. We know it exists, the virus exists. It attack us and it destroy us. And that's just one, but in a general, it's so-called the disease. Foreign invaders, the pathogens, the microbes, harmful my, my, uh, microbes and so on. So, but we are created with that capability to self-healing, self-maintenance, self self-regulation. Self this is based on the tenet of osteopathy. Go to the American Osteopathic Association, you will find a lot, you will learn a lot about your body. But your body will collapse when you do not know how to take care of yourself and you do not understand the inner cry of your body, what that is deserve as the fuel to maintain. This is what the, we are doing. So you need the fuel to live the best healthy life and wealthy life, healthy in all aspects, the physical, emotional, mental and spiritual. So let me go to the anecdotal evidence and you will see what people say. That's how we interact. And please, if you have any anecdotal evidence, do not stay th numb or deaf or blind. Please share with us. We are doing our best for you. It's your turn, please send to us, whether by email, whether by putting in your comment in a YouTube channel, one of our videos. Send us your medical checkup before and after. Let's keep this campaign to make a better world. Impact every individual on earth to be living the true healthy life. So no more suffering, no more human suffering. Thank you. Now let me start to read some of this anecdotal evidence. Anecdotal evidences, how can revitalize therapy, heart. People cure from asthma, chest pain, rhinitis allergy, or allergic rhinitis, and so on. What this person said, a male cured from asthma without inhaler. So most of the anecdotal evidence we receive are from Arab countries. That's where we started the campaign, and that's where we have most of the followers and believers. Till now, I'm here in the United States five years, but I see very few of Westerners, Americans, or English-speaking people who believe, who follow, very few. I don't know what's the reason. I don't mind, I still move forward. I do not look at a human being in terms of he or his or her culture or tradition or race or color or language. I do the best, but I say I never be the best, but always do my best to be the best. I do my best, that's up to you. You believe, fine. You implement, fine. You can then go through the bigot, which I said minutes, minutes ago. Then move forward and see by yourself. It's not gonna harm you. Do not neglect something like this. Do not be part of those who have neglected prominent people. At the end, they turn to be top people, scientists, who have changed, contributed to mega change in this world. Great impact. We need your support. We need you, but support yourself.